take a good look at our corners especially where you will find a green electric box when I think back when I was a kid the electric box was the place to be where all my friends used to gather and share stories we used to hit our hands on the box to make certain sounds and beats and laugh and make fun of the people passing by how innocent we were without any care in the world it was at these very corners we could relate the same as kids it is here on the corner where kids form their own ritual and rite of passage a sense of belonging where the child experiences a network of peers who speak alike and adopt certain codes to define the group it is at these corners where these kids go through a learnt way of viewing their peers as brothers and sisters our corners and curves could also be recruiting grounds where we find how the space draw our young people into a circle motivated by peer pressure which result from a view that this territory needs to be protected from the enemies territorial gangs in our communities are among today's main perpetrators of bolt up violence against rival gangs affecting the lives of people in the community by instilling fear these corners i refer to you are the main cause for control of a territory in which they then oversee all criminal activities the limited space in which these gangs operate is making them more visible and increasing their numbers which make it extremely dangerous for a community as a whole to survive in many parts of high risk communities children come face to face with this reality and this everyday exposure to gangs on corners and it become part of the negative conditioning i am of the belief that this group of adolescents who chill on corners seek a sense of belonging outside their homes chained together and forced to engage in criminal activities because of their internal emotional struggle to be accepted <laughs> 